In this example, we're asked to graph y is greater than 2x. So in this example, our y-intercept isn't written out, but it's implied that it's 0. So I'm going to put a point on 0. From there, our slope is 2, or 2 over 1. So I'm going to go up 2 over 1, all the way across my graph. And I'm going to go back to that y-intercept and go backwards. So go down 2 over 1. After that, I need to draw my line, and I need to know whether it's going to be solid or dashed. So here, we have just a greater than symbol. And because it's just greater than, it's going to be a dashed line. There is no equal to, so it's not a solid line. It's just a dashed line. And we put our arrows on the end because the line keeps going. So after that, we need to pick our test point so we can shade. Now, normally, I would pick 0, 0, but because it's already on the line, I need to pick something different. So I'm going to pick the point negative 1, 1, because it's very clear which side of the line that point is on. So if it's negative 1, 1, that means that our x value will be negative 1, and our y value will be positive 1. So I'm going to plug in a 1 for y and a negative 1 for x. And if we simplify, I'm going to get 1 is greater than negative 2 plus 0. So 1 is greater than negative 2. That is a true statement. So I want to shade the side of the line where that point sits. And that becomes your solution area.